Ah, yes. The day has finally come. I want to give my review of this controller. This controller here. It is, the brand is Power A. It's called the Fusion Pro. I still got the box here from when I got it at Best Buy. See that? Fusion Pro. Okay, look at where's my name. There's everything you need to know about it right there. I'm gonna go back to Best Buy um, and see if I can get my problem solved because the company, Power A, um, if you buy any of their stuff, I just they won't do anything at all. They won't, they can't even email you back. They can't respond to a message or anything. Um, and I really figured that this wouldn't be a big deal um, but it is. It really, really is. Um, I game a lot. You know, I, I like to play uh, Modern Warfare here. I like to play Warzone. This is a little bot lobby I set up just to test things out because I'm having trouble with my controller. Well, Merc, what could possibly be wrong with this controller? It's so high dollar. You spent 80 US dollars plus tax on this thing. You know, what could possibly be wrong with it? Well, I'll tell you. All right. I'll tell you. Now, you see here, I got the, you know, the stick extender on top of a stick extender on top of a long right stick. Yeah, so this controller comes with different sticks and stuff. Um, and then a stick extender, so I have a lot of range. And then these little things are precision rings. They're like 11 bucks on Amazon. They really do work. This is the medium. This is the, the firmer one. The black one's the firmer. And, you know, it, it makes your aim more precise. Um, you can tr control the recoil better, yada, yada, yada. Okay. So I'm, I'm not super great, but you know, I take Call of Duty kind of seriously. You know, I play it a lot. I have 160 something wins, you know, I play a lot of Warzone. Um, and I try to get any kind of advantage I can on people. So, you know, the headset, you know, the A50s, you know, got those, you know, got that, got the 4k monitor you know i'm gonna upgrade to the new console soon as they come available and so you know i use the paddles you know i i got the elite controller you know this thing kind of is was crapping out on me so that's why i bought this one this one was giving me problems um and i didn't want to buy another elite i didn't want to give spend you know try the series two i didn't want to spend that much money this was good this is half the price of a series two and it was just like you know, kind of fuck Microsoft for, for this piece of garbage because this is my second Elite controller. I have another Elite controller in that closet over there um, that is just garbage. Sorry, I'm getting off topic. I'm just trying to say I know what the fuck I'm talking about when it comes to these pro style kind of controllers, okay? I've been using them for years. I've mastered these paddles, okay? I don't even know how to use these buttons here. A, B, X, and Y, they might as well. You could take these off the controller and I would never notice when I'm playing Call of Duty, okay? Like, I do not use them. I have these set to eight. Um, for me, let's see, it'd be opposite. So, it's... It's A, I use this to jump, right? To jump, to crouch, okay? This one would be to swap the weapons, this is Y, okay? And this is my X. And if you've played Warzone, you played Blackout, you play these games, you know, the, the, and you play on Xbox, and I'm sure on PlayStation it's the square button, you start wearing that button out, okay? Right, you see I got this paddle missing, it's because I'm, I'm, I'm messing with it, okay? Hold on, let me set this down. I'm messing with it. Let me put this paddle in. But I'll show you the problem. I'll show you the problem. And I, I just, I figured it out. And what's happening is right here, this one. Let's see if we can get a good shot of that. Hold on. We got a, we got a light. Let's get a light. Let's make this. Okay. Here we go. Now. See this? See how it's like twisting when you push it down? It's twisting, it's worn out. The plastic is completely worn out. So when I push this paddle, it's not clicking, it's not clicking this little button here, this button. See, the button works fine, the button clicks, it, it responds when I do stuff. It's that the plastic, it's just badly designed. Look. Look at these little hinges. These are 
like so flimsy and garbage and you know yeah sometimes i do be raging a little bit too much and i've learned to calm it down and not like freak my dog out and be just a total idiot so but just any any like even when i'm not mad like i i gotta get up quick to to you know you know get to the door because the maintenance guy is here or something i set it down too hard the paddles fall out they just fall right out and then you you push them down and they're out of place and they mess the plastic up but the other three are fine i guess but it's this x button that's just horrible the y is kind of bad because of the angle that these get pulled down on like it's not an even angle like you pull down on the button you pull down on the button like this and it twists the paddle inside the holder so okay i get it it wears out right it wears out that okay so but look at this but merc they did such a you can just take that out yeah and you can just replace it right well where the fuck do you get this replacement like that's all i need this is all i need right here just this piece just a new one of these pieces that's it it fixed my problem and i could keep gaming but no i have no, i can't reload my gun and oh but merc just use the X button on your controller. Be like everybody else. Use the X button to reload and loot shit. Are you serious? Are you fucking s serious? I haven't spent the last five years mastering these these paddles on the backs of these controllers just to turn around and, and use the front button. I know it, it sounds crazy, but if you learn how to use all the paddles, you cannot you cannot go back to anything else. Um, but I'm very disappointed in this company. Like, where are you at? This company right here. So, if you consider buying this controller, just understand um, you may have to just buy a whole new controller, or if they offer some sort of warranty or something, if you plan on using paddles. Everything else is great, though. Everything else is fine. Everything else is totally fine. The sticks are fine. These buttons are fine. Like, this is fine. The bumpers are fine. Like, the triggers are fine. Everything is fine with this controller, except for this paddle, or this fucking paddle here that I used to reload. Like, I can't, I can't push the button down like this. So, on a scale of one to 10, I give it like a four. I, if I'm gonna, if you're gonna invest in a pro controller and you play on Xbox, I, I would at this point I would say try the Series Two. I heard that's uh, that's better. I can't say firsthand, but I think that's gonna be my next step. Maybe a scuff controller. I'm not sure, but I really do like this. I like the stick. I like the tension in it. Um, I'm very used to it, so it's hard for me. Like it's hard for me to want to leave this controller because I do really like it. It's just I need to get this replaced. And it's very hard to get it replaced. And I just feel like that's super fucking ridiculous. I can't just get that piece sent to me. Why can't I just give them my address? I'll pay the shipping, whatever, like you want to do. Like, But I guess my next step is to go talk to Best Buy um, and see if they can do anything for me. Um, I don't want it warranted. I just want this piece on the back. That's it. But uh, if you've watched this far, um, I'm incredibly surprised. Um, thank you for watching this little blog, a rant, um, hit that dislike button and don't forget to report. All right. Thank you. Bye.